when I was assigned the role of campus ministry intern. I applied for the position and was accepted. When you get ready for bed, you know, you turn off the lights in your house and you lock your front door and your back door and then you go to bed. My front door and back door are downstairs and quite a ways away from each other. I have about eight to ten doors that I lock before I go to bed and, lock, uh, you know, turn off all the buildings, lights, and then I come up and lock my own door. You're really central, and when you live where you work, really, uh, a lot of things fade away. You don't think about, what am I wearing? You know, uh, what's my commute like? Sometimes I roll out of bed five minutes before I need to be done in the office. As far as the space is concerned, uh, this is probably the smallest place I've ever lived. Uh, two rooms, the kitchen and the bedroom, which are about equal size. Uh, but I would say that definitely this is much closer to living in the dorms than living in an apartment. You just get the uh, added bonus of having a kitchen attached to your dorm. Whenever I say, uh, hey, my name's Alex, blah, 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 and we get to talking and I'm making a new friend or whatever, or I'm talking over dinner, and I get to the point where I say, oh, I live in a church. People, you know, laugh or think that it's bizarre that I'm making a joke on that, but I think that the perception is that it's just another part of my quirkiness. Which in reality it's uh, a reflection of my desire for service to the, the, to the community.